We appreciate all who have served. Please meet some of the amazing veterans that work here at RecTech. Check it out. My name is Darby Carpenter, and I am a senior customer call center representative. So my name is Jeff Brown. I'm the director of logistics here at RecTech. Uh, my name is Nicole Tamagdet, and I am a customer service representative. My name is Michael Coffin, and I work at the uh, customer pickup. I served in the uh, Air Force, and my rank as I retired was an E-9, Chief Master Sergeant of the Air Force, and I had 33 and a half years in the military. I proudly served the United States Army, and my rank was Corporal. I served in the United States Army, and uh, I was a, uh, I, my last rank was a United States Army First Sergeant. So I was in the Army, and when I got out, I was at the uh, rank of Captain. I was a Network Telecom uh, Communications Chief, uh, but I started off as a cable dog. Uh, a cable dog is someone who uh, puts poles in the ground, builds manholes. So I started from the bottom, and I worked my way up to a Telecom Chief. My specialized job was infantryman. Yeah, so when I was enlisted, I was a combat engineer. And then when I was an officer, I was a field artillery officer. I started out as a aircraft maintenance uh, mechanic, aircraft mechanic, and worked my way up into management. And then at the end of my career, I was in charge of aircraft maintenance operations for the flight line. I think my proudest moment was when I was a United States Army drill sergeant and uh, watching America's sons and daughters graduate across the, across the stage. Um, it was a very emotional event to help others accomplish their goals. Probably attaining the rank of chief, which is only 1% of the military members make the rank of E9 in the all branches of the military. So that was a, a big accomplishment to make chief. Yeah, we do a great job. I mean, I answer the phones when people call in and ask about stuff. We definitely take care of our veterans. We offer a discount on accessories and add-ons. Uh, well, first off, uh, soldiers, one thing I know about them and will guarantee you is that they will barbecue. So that discount enough is, has been great on us. Uh, I know it's helped me. I'd like everyone to remember on Veterans Day is just a lot of people have served their country. Just, you know, thank them because uh, it's a pretty unique thing to do, uh, to volunteer, to put your life on the line and serve your country. Just the veterans themselves that served. You know, it's, it's obviously a day for people that are still with us that uh, we appreciate their service and them, you know, making sacrifices to be able to give us the kind of lifestyle that we enjoy. It's enhanced my abilities to work on the rec tech grills, building them, be able to fix them, and, and put out a quality product. You know, and the military um, allowed me or helped me fight through a lot of adversity. And yeah, rec tech is not going to combat, but you know what, there is adversity. We're trying to get out the best product to our customers on a timely fashion. Coming from a communications background, we normally get on the we normally get on the radios and help our infantrymen uh, troubleshoot their uh, communications. It's the same thing with being a, a rec tech customer service. I jump on that phone, take that same pride, and help them uh, troubleshoot their grills and get them back in the fight. Which in this case, the fight is grilling. <laughs>